Hello and welcome back to the channel and the FA Cup is back and it's a bit of ground hopping today as we travel to Snows Stadium, the home of AFC Totten as they host Melksham. Um, so it's new ground to tick off, Gemma. I suppose you're looking forward to it. Another ground to tick off the list. Yeah, I'd be excited to see a new, a new ground and how they are. Yeah, and um, this isn't the first time we've seen AFC Totten play. Um, they actually got knocked out last year in the FA Cup by Basingstoke Town. Um, they finished 2 1 to Basingstoke, all penalty kicks in the second half. Um, so that was quite an interesting result, that one. But, um, but yeah, the FA Cup's right back. It's a wonderful competition. We can't wait to see how, it go, get, how the game goes. Going into this clash, both sides play in the same league and uh, they both have a very similar record, um, both with one win and one defeat. Although it looks like Melksham would be the ones worse off going into this game, as they lost 5-1 to Scholing last week. Um, we just want to put it out to obviously everybody that's watching. We, Bazelstoke is still our priority, uh, where we're going to be doing most videos and vlogs. But we are going to do some ground topping this season as well, just to up the channel. Yeah, just a, just a few little... Um, few games to ground hop at um, during the season. Like Jim has just said, Basel Stokes are priority. We'll be going to most of those games, but this is just for, this is both um, for us and the channel. So it's a win-win really, but we enjoy going to different grounds, seeing different teams play. And also, it, it, and also as well, it seems to be doing quite well on the channel, these sort of neutral games that we go to. Um, and it's worth noting as well, um, don't forget to subscribe if you want to carry on seeing this content and ring that notification bell to be notified when our latest non-league vlog vlogs go up. And boy, have we got a treat for you next weekend. We've got not one, not two, but three football vlogs to bring you. Um, games on a Saturday, Monday, and Tuesday night. Um, so next Saturday, Basingstoke are at hand with Villa. Monday, Basingstoke hosts Binfield on Bank Holiday Monday. And then Tuesday, we'll be going to Whitchurch versus Baffins Milton Rovers. So Gemma, um, we might nearly hit our like target on the last video we just recently uploaded. Um, but how many likes should we go for this week? I'd say 21. 21, so we're going for one more possibly. It'd be great if you could like the, smash the like button as it helps with the algorithm on YouTube and uh, hopefully we can promote non-league football um, which is quite important to me and I think it'd be great to see a lot more people be converted to non-league in general. So join us on our non-league adventure. And without further ado, let's get going to the game. So we've just got to the grounds and uh, Gemma's fair to say this is one of the nicest grounds we've actually been to, isn't it? Yeah, no matter where you go, which area you stand, they've got like little, where the steps are, like each level, so you can go on different levels for great views. As you can sort of see around here, I don't know if you can see that. Um, but yeah, we've got these nice little sections here, which are, you know, for standing, so you can't go directly beyond the, the fences here. Um, yeah, it's, very, it's a very tidy stadium, as you can see. Nice big stand here. Um, nice little club shop over there on the way through the turnstile. Overall, I think it's fair to say, very impressive. Come on. 
Let's get safe. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh So we're back from the game and it finished at the Snows Stadium in, in Totten. AFC Totten 3, Melksham 0. So um, AFC Totten progressed to the first qualifying round of the FA Cup on quite a warm day. Um, it was a very fast paced game, especially in the second half. Um, Totten scored the first goal on the stroke of half time through Scott Rendell. Um, and then from the second half onwards, it was pretty much all the hosts. Um, the second goal came from Taylor and um, the goalie just about sort of tipped it in himself so it was nearly sort of like an own goal. And then the third goal was scored by Raggetti um, to complete the win. Gemma, your thoughts on what was a quite convincing victory for the hosts? Yeah, I think in the first half they was pretty even between them. Uh, and in the second the second half uh, in the second half uh, Totten had a player number which was number 14 and I thought he was a good right winger, he was really fast paced and yeah, quick. Yeah, he was very pacey, he looked very lively down the wing, um, he was he was fantastic. Um, but Totten have got a very good side. Um, quite a bit and there was a, there was a bit of, just to add, there was a bit of fighting in, as well in the second half and one of their players got sent off a motion. Yeah, and that was the turning point in the game certainly, there was already 2-0 down at that point. Uh, but once they went the man down, that's when um, Ragate scored the third goal, which uh, ultimately won them the game. And I think it's fair to say, Gemma, that, that Totten deserved it. Like you said, it was free. The game in the first half was free equal, although I think Totten maybe had the slightly better chances. But Melchim certainly had a good uh, good few chances in the first half. In the second half, Melchim were nowhere really to be seen, apart from maybe one opportunity. Yeah. Um, so it was a very good game, very attacking from um, from Totten especially. And they were a much better side than when they came to Basel State last season. 
and when we beat them 2-1. Just want to say what a great um, little ground it was at Totten. Very modern, I think it was only built a few years ago. Great um, hospitality there, very welcoming club. Um, any non-league vloggers that, or, or sort of ground hoppers that haven't been yet, we'd highly recommend it, wouldn't we, Gem? It's a very nice little ground there. Yeah, definitely. I mean, we would love to go back there again, maybe at some point. It was really good. Yeah, who knows? Bases that might even get him in the next round. You heard it here first. But talking to Bazer Stoke, we're a bit gutted to help with Gemma because um, mm. we went to that game for a bit of ground hopping and Bazer Stoke actually won their FA Cup game 6 0 against Limington at um, the home of Brockenhurst. So well done, boys. Keep up. Well up. done, Bazer Stoke. Sorry we couldn't be there today. Obviously, we've got to try and do a few things, a few bit of ground hopping for the channel. And also, we like to ground hop as well. But great result. Never as a hat trick. Brad Wilson with two and Sam Argent with the other. It's a fantastic result. So, um, so hopefully, any Tottenham fans enjoyed watching this video. If you'd like to see, carry on watching us um, for this non league adventure, then don't forget to subscribe down below and click the notification bell to, see, um, to get notifications of when all the videos go up. We also have a, a new Facebook page. Um, just called Matitude. The link will be in the description. So feel free to like us on there for all the updates on where we're heading um, for all the games and um, what we're doing in general. And there's also, I've got my Instagram as well, which you can follow, and also on Twitter. Next week, we're back to supporting Basingstoke away at Hamworth Villa. Yep, so another new away ground to tick off on the ground hopping journey. Um, so that's a wrap for this video. If you've enjoyed, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more. But until then, thank you for watching. We will see you next, next time. time.